hello you guys and welcome back to my channel my name is Yasmin if you are new here thank you so much for clicking on today's video obviously you can tell by the title but this is a vlog from our trip to Istanbul Turkey I'm so happy to be here and I'm so happy to finally share which all we're planning to have our wedding in Istanbul we have a lot of family here and we both love it so much it's like one of our favorite cities and this has been like in the works for so long so I'm happy to finally share and bring you guys along for the process and the journey and I vlogged this entire trip we toured a bunch of venues we had a meeting with a wedding planner i went wedding dress shopping which will be in a separate video for my wedding series and it was also the first couple of days of ramadan it's actually the second day of ramadan that i'm filming this so it was just such a beautiful trip and i'm so excited to even like look over the footage i haven't looked over anything and like relive this moment and share it with y'all so make sure you are subscribed because i'll be sharing all of the content and like the journey to planning this wedding hope you guys enjoy this video like this video and comment if you have any questions i'm going to be answering all of those in like upcoming videos and i promise i will go more in depth i know in this vlog i don't get to everything Make sure you subscribe because I will be definitely answering like more questions and sharing all that content But we're so excited today's actually our last day So I just wanted to pop on here and say thank you for clicking on this video I hope you enjoy it and let's get into it Okay, we're gonna do a little Sephora haul because I went in to restock a couple of things that I was out of. I was out of sunscreen and my Charlotte Tilbury color corrector. First thing I got is the Summer Fridays um, sunscreen. This is one of my favorite sunscreens. I was out of mine. I normally use the Biosense one. Got this Laneige lip sleeping mask. I haven't had one of these in so long, but this specific scent, Sweet Candy, oh my goodness, it's like 1 million percent the best scent out of all of them the charlotte tilbury color corrector the shade medium and i always use this under concealer i've been seeing this like face primer from refai all over my social media like i always see girls using this and it looks super dewy and hydrating so i was like you know what we're gonna try it it's glow and sculpt i only got my hands on their lip sculpt i feel like i've wanted this for like a year and again it's never in stock this thing i got is the summer fridays jet lag mask this is a mini this is like my holy grail the best like hydrating mask ever so i got all of that from sephora thank you so much you too starbucks and today is such an exciting day because it's officially the day that we leave for our big international trip Morning. Say good morning. We're in Istanbul. This gorgeous terrace. It's actually a sunny day out. We didn't vlog yesterday because it was really cloudy and rainy, but it's a beautiful sunny day today. The weather is stunning. We watched the sunrise this morning and it was probably one of the most beautiful views I've ever seen and so now we're just getting ready because we are doing some venue tours this morning I'm so excited we have one at 11 and then another one right after that my mom and her um, cousin are gonna come pick us up stop and explain but my mom is also here I have some family here and they've been helping us out with like all the wedding stuff so it's been really really nice to have like family here and it's been so fun we're getting ready right now we're in a little bit of a rush because we want to grab a bite to eat before our venue tour um, and they're a little bit far away from each other and Istanbul traffic is kind of crazy so we're gonna head out that's on the agenda today we're so excited this is like our I feel like this is like our first real full day here like actually doing wedding stuff so we're really excited doing my makeup in here I tried out this new primer from refi for the first time today I have like a ton of new products that I've just been loving I want to do like full hair and makeup today because I didn't even get ready yesterday it was like so rainy and gross I was like I do not want to do makeup right now okay it's time to do a little outfit of the day this is the look it's very comfy casual but still cute I'm gonna be walking around a lot so I didn't want anything too uncomfortable um, I'm wearing the skims fits everybody collection 
long sleeve bodysuit. This skirt is from Revolve, I will link it. I'm wearing my New Balance 574s. This belt is from Madewell, my everyday jewelry, my everyday bag. I'm really excited, I'm just bringing like a little trench coat because I feel like I might get cold. It's definitely like windy here, so I wanna have a jacket. And let me show you the sunglasses I'm gonna bring. These are the sunglasses for today. They're really fun. They match the whole vibe. Go. We're gonna call our little car to take us to a coffee shop, and then we're gonna meet my mom. We're on our way to the first venue. This is Seper. Seper, saw him on about YouTube. We chat. He doesn't want to be on it. Yeah. By the way, I want to be a vlogger. You want to be a vlogger? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Why not? Yeah. Why not? Okay, yes, I will. Oh, she's ready. <laughs> she's like, I'm ready for my shot. Baddie's here. The whole crew is here. What were we doing yesterday? Where were we going? What do you mean? Like, why was my mom picking us up? Where were we going? We were going to meet for the meeting with the wedding planner. Oh, okay. So we had a meeting with a wedding planner yesterday at a hotel. And I wanted my mom to be there, obviously. And so she's staying with her cousins because I have family here. They're staying with their cousins. And it was just so funny because she was like, okay, we're on our way. And me and Mustafa look at each other. We're like, wait, who's we? Like, we had no idea. And I was also like, how is my mother driving these crazy streets by herself? And she pulls up like a whole giant, like, black like SUV minivan and it's all my Iran family in the back and then everyone just pulled up to the meeting with the wedding planner it was just so funny and I was like this just feels like so motherland like yeah. so funny like all your cousins and like aunties in the back like it was just really funny Turkish bagel. <laughs> day three today is such an exciting day because I am going wedding dress shopping for the very first time I've never gone wedding dress shopping and I have my mom here in Istanbul to come with me I need to leave soon I'm just finishing up steaming my dress do not mind the like very dirty we have a very dirty room right now but I'm just steaming my dress or I'm trying to steam it we're having like so many random issues with like the voltage and like plugging things in and having your like US appliances work overseas so that's something I didn't expect so I'm hoping that I can fix the wrinkles in this dress as it's so beautiful um, and I bought it just for this occasion but I'm really excited today to just like try on as many things as I can my hair and makeup all nice I wanted to like go in looking somewhat similar to what I would look like on my wedding day to be able to like fully envision the dress and I wanted to dress up and have like a nice outfit just to like you know make more of the experience and make it more of like a, a memory and like a special occasion so I'm really excited so I'm gonna finish up ironing this dress I'm meeting my mom there we need to like call a taxi or do something i swear like getting around in this city has been so challenging for me so far but yeah we're gonna go over there i really need a coffee so maybe my mom and i can get something or maybe at the bridal store they'll give us one of those I know some words. Yeah, that's why it would be easier. You guys. Wow, the weather is beautiful. Do you see these stairs? I literally hike up these and I can like barely walk because this dress is like so tight on the bottom. And I walk like a funny, funny person. We're literally all traumatized from uh, the morning we just had. Literally, I vlogged this morning. I was like, I'm on my way to go wedding dress shopping. <laughs> and I did a vlog from that moment on until now. Azad. Yeah, someone Nazar that's so bad. We ended up missing our appointment. I got locked out of my phone. Mom got locked out of her bank. Everyone's cars were declining. No one knew where they were. Round two, we were able to squeeze in another appointment later in the day.
Okay, you guys, I literally just passed out for like five hours and now it's, what time is it? 1.26 a.m. And it's the first day of Ramadan. So Ramadan Mubarak. This is obviously being posted after the first few days, but I hope you're all having a blessed Ramadan so far. Got like some groceries and stuff to have for Suhoor because we don't have anything in our Airbnb. So we just got like some fruit. Obviously it's gonna look different like Suhoor at our own house because I think that would do like oats and something. But what do we get? We got like yogurt. What is this? Activia. Probiotic yogurt. We got some bread. Oh my God, did you get gummy bears? Yeah, sorry. Oh, I've been wanting to get some like halal gummies here and like I need to stock up before I go back home But that is so cute. Thank you. And This is the dates. These look so good. Were We're gonna have some suhoor And then tomorrow we have a packed day first day of Ramadan Say hi. Where's your outfit from? Rival. Rival. Show me your pants. Look at that. They have a cute little cuff. Okay. This is, which one was this one? This is raspberry. Rose. No, this is raspberry coconut. This is rose. Lemon pistachio, and then this was milk, milk, milky coke. Oh, I know. <laughs> 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 Caramel. Caramel. It was a truffle. Caramel. It was <laughs> Caramel. Caramel. It was a, okay, babe. It was, I got Caramel. it. Okay, my mind. This is a milk truffle with caramel. <laughs> okay, my mom got an eclair. I got a fruit tart. And then our sweet chocolates. What was this one? Pistachio? It's like a pistachio cookie. Uh, short bread. I'm really in my Turkish coffee era because I was saying, America, you get like a huge portions of coffee, Mon, don't you think? Like in America, you'll literally get like a tall coffee, and here they just give you like a tiny little glass, and it's like classy, and it's very efficient. Like their coffee is so strong, and it's like very smooth, so you don't need that much, and there's like not that much sugar in it. And even when I got a coffee out, like not just the Turkish coffee, I got a latte, their portions are like so tiny. Like smaller than like a Trenti at Starbucks. Anyways, I'm in my Turkish coffee. It's strong, Garam, it's strong. They give you water. Yeah. And we just went to the Chiragan Palace and like took a bunch of pictures. It was so beautiful and like toured it. It was stunning. And now we're on our way to Nishantashi, which is like a street in Istanbul where there's like a ton of like boutiques. <laughs> A uh, ton of like wedding dress boutiques and stuff. A ton of you guys recommended that I go there and check it out because I just was not having good luck with the other places. Like nothing was really aligning with like my vision and like what I wanted. So we're gonna try it again today. I'm feeling some better vibes. I am just like praying I can find something. But a lot of you also said that like it took a while to find the perfect dress and like I only really started like a couple days ago. So I'm not pressed. I'm just excited and I'm keeping an open mind. Good morning. It is our official last day in Istanbul, which is so crazy to think about. I feel like we've had like the longest week here. Hey, <laughs> why are you standing there looking free? What are you thinking about? Today is our last day, and I feel like we've been doing a lot of wedding stuff, and we just like want to experience like Istanbul for the rest of the day and like do some fun touristy things. So it's actually Jumma. It's the second day of Ramadan, which is so special. Oh my goodness, I have to tell you about last night. We broke our fast by the Hagia Sophia. We prayed Maghrib there, and they had like just dates and sweets and like lentil soup and all that. And they were passing it around to everyone who was breaking their fast. And then all of a sudden, like when it was time to break our fast, like the Adhan went off and it was like the Adhan from so many different masjids. So it was so loud and so beautiful. And I was literally just sitting there like, oh my goodness, I cannot believe I'm living this moment right now. It was so 
surreal and so beautiful and I feel so happy that we chose to come here during Ramadan because it's truly been such a special experience and I just feel like nothing is like Ramadan in a Muslim country honestly so that's been very beautiful. So today our plan is to go to the Salimania Masjid. I feel like, I don't know if I'm saying that right. And um, we're gonna go there for a Jummah. It's like super beautiful. We're gonna go to the Grand Bazaar and then get like gifts for our family um, and friends and stuff. People who like, you know, we wanna bring sweets and stuff for, for Ramadan, like baklava. They have spices there and it's just really iconic. I don't think I even came to the Grand Bazaar the last time I was in Istanbul, which was so long ago. Oh yeah, we wanna go to the Topkapi Palace. There's like a lot of really beautiful Beautiful Islamic history there and yeah we're just gonna hang around and then tonight we have to go see my grandma who lives in Iran um, she's been in Turkey this whole time too visiting her siblings who live here um, and we have to say bye to her because she's going back to Iran and we don't know the next time we'll see each other and then we're also going to pay our, our visits to my grandma's brother um, and just like some family and stuff before we head out and then tomorrow morning our flight leaves at what like 8? Yeah. Yeah, we've, our flight leaves at eight, so we have to leave the house at like five or something. And then we have a very long travel day, but we should arrive in San Diego, inshallah, by like five-ish p.m. on Saturday, which is the nice thing about like traveling back in time because it's like, we still have all Sunday to like get everything together, but I feel like it's been a pretty productive trip. I promise when I get home, I will be like answering so many questions. I feel like I don't even know what this vlog is gonna turn out like because I'm just trying to film here and there and there's just, I don't know, it's just chaotic and I'm trying to like be in the moment and film on like my phone and my camera and all that, but I promise I will be home and I'll answer all of your questions. I'm gonna be doing an entire wedding series on my YouTube and that's gonna be like dedicated to the wedding. Um, a full in-depth like wedding dress shopping experience vlog will be the first episode of the wedding series. So all of that is coming. I will be sharing everything on like my other platforms as well. But for the rest of Ramadan, I'm gonna be doing Ramadan vlogs on YouTube. So that's like the main content. So make sure you're subscribed. I feel like I have always said this, I love YouTube so much because it's super personal and we get to like chat on such a deeper level. And I love watching Ramadan vlogs and like I cannot wait to make my own so I'm very excited I'm trying to recap oh yeah yesterday we also went to this neighborhood neighborhood called Nishantashi which is like a really I don't know it was like a it felt like a trendier part of town there was so much shopping like I could tell everyone just goes there to shop um there's like so many different types of stores. Specifically, I was looking at all the wedding dress stores. There were so many, they were like lining the streets. Um, I did not find the one yet, so whatever. We'll keep looking. I'm not rushed on time, thank God, but like, yeah, I think I just had to manage my expectations because I totally thought I was gonna come to Turkey and like leave with the dress, but it's just not like that. But anyways, we're gonna head out now and I will try and get as much footage as I can of the rest of the day. Okay, before we head out, I wanna show you my outfit because I really love it. I can't even tell if this room looks messy in the background, please. Excuse me for that because I swear, like when I'm on trips, like I'm just, I'm so clean when I'm at home, but when I'm on trips, I feel like I'm getting ready and there's like clothes everywhere. It's like just so much harder to stay clean. But anyways, this is my outfit for today. We're going to the mosque, like I said. Gonna go to the Grand Bazaar and do that kind of stuff. So I wanted something that was like, you know, the Ramadan vibe. I'm wearing this like beautiful kaftan dress thing that I got from Mango. I swear Mango has been killing it lately with their clothes. I don't know what it is, but they have so many beautiful and affordable modest dress options. And of course, I will be linking every single piece that I wear on this trip um, in the description box. Also check my Instagram because I will definitely be linking everything there and on my like to know it. But anyways, this dress is from Mango. It is so stunning. It has kind of like a low front, so I wore this Skims bodysuit under it. And when I originally got it, it had a huge like slit up to the side, which I don't even know why they did that, but I got that altered. That was like one of the things that I was getting altered. Um, if you watch the pack and prep with me vlog, um, but I got it altered and I feel like it's perfect. Ideally, I would have had her close this up a little bit more. I think I had asked her and I don't know like what happened with that, but I'm bringing this hijab anyways, because we obviously need to pray. And I've been carrying this black bag the whole time. So I feel like it really matches with the fit. 
I'm gonna wear my loafers because I need to be comfortable. I swear we do so much walking here and the way our like Airbnb is like situated, it's like so far down um, this like huge flight of stairs. And it was funny because like the first couple days that I was here, I had dresses that like I had altered by closing up the slit. So I could not walk that well in them. And I was like trying to go up the steps and I literally looked insane um, walking up there. So I feel like these people probably thought I looked crazy and I clearly am screaming that I'm a foreigner. Um, just by like how I look and stuff. But anyways, this is the fit. I will link it. I have like just my standard gold jewelry on. Definitely ready to go home and like ready to experience Ramadan at home and like be with our families and stuff. And I feel like, I don't know, if you guys have been here or if even if you've been like anywhere in Europe, like specifically Italy, Turkey reminds me a lot of Italy. Like I just feel like customer service is just so much better in the States. And just like, I don't know, I feel like here everyone's just trying to hustle you and that's just the culture. Also today, I wanna to get some like halal gummies and candies while I'm here. Um, and then I also wanna look and see if I can find like a cute prayer set. Cause I feel like the ones that I have are so busted. Tell me if you relate to this. Cause I feel like everyone has some busted prayer sets that are like 15 years old and they're like floral and ugly and just like crusty. So I wanna get some nice prayer sets if I can find one. And then a John M. Moss, like a prayer mat. It'd also be a cute gift like maybe for my sisters um, or someone. But anyways, we're gonna go now. I will see you guys in a little bit. We're on our way to the Soleimaniya Masjid. We're so excited. I've never been here. And I've heard it's like one of the prettiest ones. So we're so excited. And I can't believe it's our last day here. We're gonna miss it. He looks so cute, bestie. Where's your outfit from? Yeah. Where is the top from? Yeah. Cute. And the shoes, same shoes. Scarf, koja. Where is the scarf from? Vila. Cute. reminds me so much of Iran. It's crazy. 